In a previous video, I briefly described the elemental composition and dramatic light changing qualities of one of my Hackmanite samples. This video more closely examines the amazing qualities of this sample. The sample is translucent uh, in indoor light, uh, white light, as well as red and green laser light. But with exposure to long wave UV, it fluoresces a beautiful, bright, California poppy orange color. Uh, within seconds, the exposure causes the cream-colored sample to begin to shift to a violet and then a deep purple color when seen in white light. The orange fluorescence is triggered by the same long-wave UV light that causes this security strip to fluoresce. Short-wave UV produces much less fluorescence, but still produces the shift to the purple color. When the cream-colored sample is exposed outside to direct sunlight, it immediately begins shifting to the purple color. Here you see the color change in real time and sped up tenfold. Uh, this change to purple takes about one minute. The change from purple back to the cream color is termed bleaching, and here you can see the color change occurs slowly under room LED lights. By two hours, the bleaching is basically complete. I think it's very interesting that sunlight through a window will not produce the purple color change. On the contrary, uh, it in fact bleaches the Hackmanite. What happens if you keep the purple form of Hackmanite in the dark? When the color change to purple is induced with UV light and the sample is put in the dark, bleaching doesn't occur and the purple color remains at 2 hours and even at 24 hours in the dark. Lasers produce very intense light of a very specific wavelength. After 3 minutes of laser exposure to a single spot on the Hackmanite, that spot is bleached while the surrounding area remains purple. This effect is also seen with the red laser. Some reports suggest Hackmanite can respond to X-ray and gamma radiation. I have a uranium ore sample that emits gamma radiation. When I placed the bleached Hackmanite on the uranium ore and kept both in the dark for 12 hours, I saw no effect. The purple Hackmanite also showed no signs of bleaching with the uranium ore exposure. What causes the Hackmanite's very unusual color changes? Research is ongoing, but it seems that electron energy level changes as well as actual movement of atoms within the crystal structure of Hackmanite may account for the results observed. With the higher energy UV light, the Hackmanite fluoresces orange and also shifts to the purple color. Lower energy light in the visible range reverses the purple color change as was seen with the white LED light exposure and the green and red laser bleaching. Thanks for watching and please consider subscribing.